I'm Dominic Preziosi, and I'm the editor of Commonweal Magazine. I arrived at Commonweal in 2012 as the digital editor, and I almost can't believe how quickly the time has gone by. Of course, it's fair to say that 2020 has been a year like no other for Commonweal. Since March, our staff has been working almost entirely remotely, not only putting out the monthly magazine, which is a pretty big job, but also tending to the website, our podcast, our newsletters, and our events. We've had our share of highlights, though, this year. Uh, maybe you saw our special April, April issue on the state of the American parish, an issue many months in the planning and drawing on contributions from the entire staff and featuring the work of a number of great writers. We also dedicated coverage to the pandemic and its impact on politics, culture, and spiritual life, to racism and racial justice in American society and within the church, and, of course, to the 2020 election. I've been very gratified to see these efforts pay off. Our print circulation is growing, and while our online readership is a historic high, and our podcast is gaining new listeners all the time, we're also publishing a lot of new writers and inviting more and more new readers into our community. If 2020 has taught me something, it's that we need Commonweal in these times, perhaps now more than ever. I think you'll agree, and if you do, I'm asking that you support us. Thank you. <laughs>